I've uploaded this video on Insta and many of you have asked for a tutorial so here it is. If you know the basics of 3D edit this will be easy for you. So I'm going to bring in a fusion composition and switch to the fusion tab. Now add a background and set the alpha value to zero. These are the nodes we'll be using for the 3D edit. First I will add a render node then a merge 3D and an image plane node. Then I will connect them together. Next, I will bring another image plane node and a multi-merge node, as well as a background node, and change the alpha value to zero. Now, connect them all. Now bring your image and connect it to the merge node. Add a text here. I'm going to use my own preset. So I will drag it here and connect it to the merge node. Now I'm going to make some quick changes to my text. Copy all these nodes and paste them here. Now connect the image plane node like this. Now select the 3D merge here and turn on the second viewer. Select the image plane and drag it to the right position like this. Once it's done, add a 3D camera and simply connect it to the merge node. Now you just need to adjust the camera like this. Once you're done, go to frame zero and add a keyframe here. Now frame 30, add another. Go back to the first frame and bring the camera towards the image, something like this. Move forward a few frames and add another keyframe. Now, go to frame 60. And push the camera to the right side. Add another keyframe at frame 63. Move forward to frame 110. And bring the camera back. Adjusting the position like this, we need both images to come into one frame. Now I will smooth the animation. To do that, turn on the spline edit. I'm gonna do little quick, so just select all. I'm gonna choose out cubic. Almost done. Now I'm going to make a rectangle shape around the image. So I'll add another image plane node, then add a background and a rectangle. Connect them together. Select the background node and turn on the first viewer. We will adjust the rectangle shape. In the inspector, turn off the solid option and increase the border width as desired. Once you've done that, connect the image plane node with the merge node. It's not perfect yet. We need to make some quick changes. In the inspector, increase the size and adjust the position as shown. Select the rectangle. At frame 70, add a keyframe and go forward a few frames to add another keyframe. Go back to the first frame and bring the length value to zero. It's still not ready yet, as you can see there's a single dot. Add another keyframe at frame 70, then go forward one frame and add another keyframe. Now bring the value to zero and it's done. You can download the project file from here, link in my description. Also don't forget to check out my text preset pack.